lucid, I love the way you drive, baby. Got me staring at the wheel, it's perfect time, baby. I do. do MK, you want to say it or you don't want to say it? What's up, y'all? So, um, I ain't gonna lie, I need to clean my car out, draw Like, my car is so messed up, it don't even make no fucking sense. But, y'all, um, I know y'all clicked on this title. And y'all probably like MK. What you got? What you got to say this time, y'all? I ain't gonna lie. Like, I'm the type of girl where like I don't really know how to like I don't know how to like express my feelings to like human beings. You feel me? Like I don't know how to express my feelings and stuff to like actual people. Like I don't, I just don't know. You feel me? Like that's something I'm gonna have to work. You know, work on. You know, as 2024 keep on going by. But like I just like to talk to y'all and I like to tell people. I like to tell y'all stuff first. Like anything that I tell y'all, like anything big that y'all ever hear from me. Like, I tell y'all first. I don't tell nobody else. I don't tell my mama. I don't tell my grandma. You feel me? I don't tell my sisters, my little sisters. Like, I don't tell none of them. I don't tell none of them first. I always tell y'all first because, like, y'all really just, like, get me. You feel me? I'm not saying that other people don't get me, but, like, I know y'all won't judge me. I know whatever I say or whatever I do, like, y'all gonna support me. Y'all gonna show me the most love. Y'all gonna, y'all gonna, y'all gonna do what y'all supposed to do. You feel me? And I really appreciate y'all for that. Um... But today's video is a little bit different. I ain't got no food. I ain't got nothing. I just got a Gatorade and I got some water, okay? But y'all know, if y'all haven't been tuning to my videos, that I have pneumonia, okay? I got diagnosed with pneumonia uh, two days ago. They said I had pneumonia in my uh, left chest. If y'all want to see that vlog, all y'all have to do is click the link in the description box. It's going to be the only link in the description box. Y'all can go check out that vlog. Um, it was a very interesting vlog for people who are sick right now or you know, maybe you just, I don't know, you just want to be in my business, you feel me? It's in the its in the description box, you feel me? But, I've been having pneumonia for the past two days, and I haven't left the house. Um, I haven't left the house for two days. Um, I've just been kind of like, you know, in the bed, watching YouTube videos or editing videos. Like, I've still been posting, as y'all can see. Like, I have so much footage that I never dropped. So it's like, this actually came in handy because the footage that I did not get to post for y'all, like, I'm posting now. So that's why, like, these videos y'all are seeing, a lot of this stuff is kind of like old footage. Um, so it's not like current reactions and current stuff. A lot of this stuff is old stuff that I had in my, you know, my uh, laptop that I'm uploading for y'all because it was good stuff. But overall, like, I, I feel okay, you feel me? I'm not at my best, um... I say I'm, a, I'm about a good, I'm about a good six, you feel me, like a, I'm a, I'm a week, I'm a week six right now, you feel me, I'm a week six right now, but I've been taking my medicine, they gave me, um, like some medicine called Levitin or something, or however you pronounce it, and it basically said that I'm on that for 10 days straight, uh, you guys know I lost my job, I still have not found a job yet, I have been talking to people, you feel me, about jobs and stuff like that, and I've been having, you know, stuff in motion or whatever, I'm just waiting, I'm right, right now, like, I'm just waiting until my health get better, because even if I was to get another job or something like that, like, I can't even work right now, because I have, you know, pneumonia, and they don't want you doing anything for, like, 10 days straight, you feel me, it was actually funny, though, because the, the, the place, the hospital I went to, they gave me, like, a little, uh, they gave me, like, a little job, like, you know, the little forms that people have, like, saying like they can't come in they gave me that and i'm looking at this like what am i supposed to do with this like i don't have a job like what am i supposed to do with this but you feel me so i just been at home you know watching uh videos and stuff like that and just like really trying to take care of myself like i really want y'all to start taking care of yourself and i'm not saying mk don't take care of stuff like i'm very good with like self-care like it might not seem like it but mk is really 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 like strong on self-care like like I get on here laughing shit because that's like, you know, my inner, like, I have to entertain y'all. But when I cut this camera off and stuff like that, like, I be going to parks, I be reading books, I be, um, like, watching motivational videos, I be going to the gym, um, I be, I be just, you know, taking time, like, I cut my phone off some days and don't even, you know, be on it, like, I be actually having, like, real life self-care, you know, days and stuff like that. And, um, yeah, that's really what I've just been doing. And, uh, getting to the title of this video, because I don't even know what I was just talking about that. Y'all probably don't care about none of that shit I was talking about. But getting to the title, um, a lot of people probably been wondering, like, MK, like, are you in a relationship right now? Like, what's up with your relationship statuses? Because, like, I know you was in a relationship and you ain't in one either. And, y'all, I just picked up this book. Well, I've been picked up this book, but I'm a really big fan of Mike Todd, y'all. Like, 
he had a book called Crazy Faith. Um, I actually read that whole entire book probably in like 30 days. It was on my YouTube channel. Y'all can go check that out. And then I gave my mom and them. I gave my mom another Mike Todd book. It was dealing with like relationship. I think it's called Relationship Goals or something like that. I gave that to my mama and my mama and my sisters. My mama, well, my mama got that book. And then I gave my sisters and my mama the Crazy Faith book. They bought their own books. And then I just picked up this book. This is about, I haven't even read it. I only read like maybe like five pages. But I'm going to get into this, you know, while I'm healing and stuff like that. But it's called Damage But Not Destroy. Uh, because if y'all don't know, like, I have a lot of trauma right now. Um, I have a lot of, like, I have a lot of open wounds right now that happened to me, you know, over the past couple of months. You feel me? Especially, like, last year. Like, last year, that was, like, a very, very, like, it was a very, like, painful and, and like, traumatizing year for me. Like, it was very traumatizing and, um... It, it took a lot in me, it took a lot in me to even get to this point, because, like, right now, like, I'm still, you know, going through certain wounds and stuff like that, but, like, they're, they're starting to heal, you feel me, like, they're starting to heal, and that, and that, and that came with, that came with me having to really just, like, sit down and really focus on God and stuff like that, like, I'm a very, very, very strong believer in God, and I encourage all of y'all to start getting, you know, into God, like, but yeah, I had a lot of open wounds last year and I wouldn't even normally talk about stuff like this, but I'm I'm feeling open and stuff like that to tell y'all my story and stuff like that. But I had a lot of open wounds last year. Um a lot of bad stuff happened to me. Um I had a lot of people, a lot of friends that turned fake on me. I had family that turned on me. Um I, I, I just had I had a lot of people that did a lot to me. And it was all because of me being a, a, a nice person and me always wanting to help people. Like, I'm somebody that loves helping people. I love trying to get people to the next level. I love uh, I love just putting other people first instead of putting myself first. And I have a problem with, like, setting boundaries. You feel me? And, you know, I've been starting to, like, I literally just had a flashback right there. But I've been starting to like set boundaries and stuff like that, and it, and it, and a lot of people help me though. A lot of people help me get to this point. Like, oh my god, why am I about to cry? But a lot of people like help me. A lot of people help me get to this point in my life, and I'm just so thankful, and I'm glad that people caught certain signs that I didn't catch, um, because it was it was it was a hard it was a hard year for me, and um. It, it was just a hard year for me but anyways get off of that subject so um y'all wonder what mk so <coughs> i still got that cough a little bit but i am not in a relationship y'all so ever since my whatever you feel me because i don't talk on that i don't talk on that no more but ever since that you know situation happened or whatever um i have been doing a lot of healing and stuff like that but i didn't really have to heal from that relationship because like i was already doing healing anyways like like, I'm gonna keep it a man. Like, I really did not care. Like, like I care because the soul ties and everything, you know, that comes with, you know, you know, situations or like that. But truth be told, like, I really did not care. Like, I was doing stuff, you feel me? Like, y'all, I was, y'all, one thing about him came when it's time to go, it's time to go, okay? But we not even gonna talk about that. But yeah, I'm not in a relationship right now. Um, as, as far as a relationship go, like, I have been talking to people, y'all. Like, I'm not going to cap. Like, when I, when I left that relationship, like, it don't take me that long to, like, like get over somebody. Like, I can get over somebody like that. You hear me? Like, it really, because, cause, like, I'm the, I'm the foundation of the relationship. Like, I'm the foundation. I'm, I'm bringing everything to the table all the time. I'm the one with the love. I'm the one, like, like, I'm not saying I'm, like, just the best person in the world, but I come with a lot, and you're going to miss me regardless. You feel me? Like nobody can take my place. Nobody can like, you're going to always miss me. You're going to always want to be in my, you know, want me to be a part of your life. Like that's just how it go. And it's not even just dealing with, you know, that person, like all of my relationships, y'all, I've had plenty of relationships. Like this is not my first rodeo. I've had plenty of relationships and I kid y'all not right hand of God, no boy. Every person is still on my trail to this day. I swear on my life. I'm not guessing. I'm not hyping myself up. Like, every everybody is still on my trail to this day. You see what I'm saying? And that just goes to show that I'm a really good person. I'm very honest. I'm very truthful. I'm very loyal. Um, I, I look out for I look out for my people. You feel me? I always put my people first. You see what I'm saying? Until you start doing me wrong or you start disrespecting me, then it's like, okay, bet. But yeah, though, I'm not in a relationship, but I have been talking to people. You feel me? 
Um, I, I did almost get into a relationship uh, not too long ago. Matter of fact, I, I almost got into a serious relationship. But um, one day I had like a little dream or whatever. I had like a little dream and like that dream... Because I'm, I'm picking up on size now. I had a dream or whatever. And when I woke up from out of that dream, it was like a dream. I had woke up out of that dream. And something just told me, like, you need to leave this person alone. Like, this person is no good for you. Like, like even though it hurts you, feel me? Because I really had love for that person. And, like, like I don't know. I just be understanding people. Because, like, I'm a Pisces. I'm very, like, I'm very, like, internally woke. You feel me? Like, I'm very in tune with my emotions and stuff like that. And I really had, like, like strong feelings for this person. But something just told me, like, nah, MK, like, you need to cut them off, like, like, they're not, they, they can't, like, they can help you, but, like, it's just not gonna mix well, you feel me, because they was in a, they was in, like, a different, like, light to me, if, if that makes sense, like, they was still, like, I'm gonna keep it a band with y'all, like, MK, like, like, this is a backstory, like, I ain't saying I'm hood and shit, but, like, I know a lot of stuff, like, I know a lot of stuff, y'all, like, I didn't did stuff, I didn't, I'm telling y'all, like, I know about all that stuff, like, nothing, not, like, it's like, nothing's really new to me, y'all, like, I know a lot of stuff, you feel me, and I've done a lot of stuff, you feel me, so it's like, that person, like, he was just in, he was just in a light that I just didn't want to be in no more, you feel me, like, I've always been, like, a girl who loved chasing her goals, who loved, like, having a clear slate, like, I don't like, I don't like doing bad stuff, I don't like, like, I don't like that type of stuff, you feel me, and it was, like, with this person, like, I found myself, like, falling into that lane. Like, I was doing, you know, bad stuff. I was, I was just, like, it was just a bad look. Like, you know, it was a bad look for myself. And I started to feel myself kind of, like, falling in a deep end. Like, a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff just started happening when I was dealing with that person. Like, it was just a lot of bad stuff. Like, like I'm telling y'all, like, it was a lot of bad stuff that I was just doing. And I started to realize, I'm like, wait, MK, like, you need to leave this person alone. Because if you don't leave this person alone, like, it's only going to be one or two options. Like, either you're going to be in jail or something's going to happen to you. You feel me? So, um, I ended up having to leave that person alone. It's no bad blood, but it's like, some people you just got to leave behind. You feel me? And, you know, even if I you know, happily run, run across that person or something like that, like, you know, like, I still, you know, you know, I still speak and stuff like that, but it's like, as far as, like, relationship-wise, nah, so, yeah, I was, like, you know, it's somewhat of a relationship, it, you know, it wasn't no, okay, anyways, off of that, but, yeah, so, I was, I was, in like, somewhat of a relationship, like I told you, like, sometimes it's hard for me to express myself, but, yeah, so, I was somewhat in a relationship, then I kind of, like, broke it off, you feel me, then, you feel me, I was, you know, I was just talking to people, you feel me, I was just talking to people, like, just on some cool shit, you feel me, nothing too crazy, and, um, like, right now, like, current day is June, June 10th, I think, or June 9th, it's one of these days, I don't know, because I haven't really been on my phone, I think it's probably, today is fucking Monday, but, um, currently speaking, um, I'm not talking to anyone, um, I'm not gonna lie, though, I do... Do, MK, you want to say it or you don't want to say it? I'm not going to lie, y'all. So, I'm not talking to nobody right now. But, like, it is, like... It is, like... It's on some shit, like, if it happened, it happened type of deal. You feel me? Like, I'm not really tripping. You feel me? Like, I'm not really tripping on it. You feel me? Like, it's kind of one of those things where it's, like, if it happened, it happened. If it don't, it don't. You see what I'm saying? Like... That's the type of deal it is. Like, it's on some shit like that. Like, like I'm like, like you feel me? Like, oh my god, I can't believe I'm saying this right now. MK, stop playing with these folks. No, but for real though, y'all. Like, <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, y'all. Sometimes I just be having these moments where I just be having myself dead. But no, though, like, <laughs> it's also stuff where it's like. If it happened, it happened. If it don't, it don't. Like, like, I ain't really tripping, though. You feel me? Like, because right now, like, I'm just trying to focus on, like, I'm really trying to focus on myself, y'all. I'm trying to, like, I'm really just trying to get myself together because, like, you know, it's good for you. You feel me? But, yeah, though. I normally don't drink yellow Gatorades, y'all. But they say if you drink yellow Gatorades, I guess it's supposed to be, like, 
I guess it's supposed to like have more like stuff inside of it. Like I don't know, I don't know. Look it up. But that's a true statement. I just don't know. I just don't know all about it because I don't give a fuck. But yeah, though they said like the yellow Gatorade is supposed to have the you know the most like I don't hi hydration or whatever the fuck Gatorades do. That's what they said. So I ended up getting the yellow one, but I normally get the blue one. Like y'all see this one? I normally do the blue. Or the uh or the white. I do the white, the blue, or the dark blue. But they said this one right here do they do the job too. <laughs> and then they was telling me I need to drink Sprite. I don't know why they say drink Sprite. Like that actually don't make no type of sense. Like I know get it ready, it hydrates you, keep you hydrated, stuff like that, but Sprite, like, that don't make no type of sense. But yeah though. So I really just been in the house, y'all. <laughs> And I'm actually kind of glad that I've been in the house because I've been saving a lot of money. And I on top not and I'm not only on top of that, but like it's just good to be by yourself. Like I anybody out there that's like, you know, living by themselves or out there by themselves, like, it's good to be alone. You feel me? Like you ain't gotta be alone all the time, but it's good to just be by yourself. It's it's great. It's great for your mental, it's great for your energy, it's great for your peace. Like, like when it comes down to it, y'all, like when I find my apartment and stuff like that, because that's going to be coming up soon, too. But when I find my apartment and stuff like that, like, I'm not really, like, I be partying and stuff. Like, I'm a party girl. Like, I be turned up. I be outside. You feel me? Like, I really be doing that. You feel me? Like, on my real life, like, I really be outside, y'all. Like, I'm not playing. Like, I had somebody pull up on me one day. They talking about something. Man, I be seeing you all around the city. Like, and I'm like, yeah, like, I be outside. You feel me? Like, you feel me? I got a lot of people out here. That's why it's kind of another thing. It's kind of hard for me to leave my city because, like I said, I plan on moving to Texas, y'all. Like, whoop, you know, okay, and Kay's going to Texas. Like, I plan on going to Texas very soon. Like, I got family out there. Like, my actually, my Texas family, they actually, if y'all go on my YouTube, on my Instagram, y'all got to follow me on Instagram. But my people on Instagram, we had did, like, a rap battle. So, if y'all looked at that, them people... They was, they actually from Texas. Like, that's my, that's my lit family. Like, that's my family who be doing the drinking. The, like, that's the, that's the family I really, be, I really want to hang with. You feel me? Like, that's my family. You feel me? So they had came out here or whatever. Cause like, it was a birthday or whatever like that. <coughs> so like, I got a lot of family that's down like in Texas. You feel me? Like all my, like not all my family, like my immediate family is down here, but like my other family, like they're down in texas so like i plan on moving out in texas and i know it's gonna be lit y'all like i already know it's gonna be lit like one thing about mk like when she touched down to a city like bro the cities be loving me like it don't matter what city i'm in like the cities love me like i got family all around the city like i even thought about moving to atlanta one time because that's where i'm really from y'all i'm from atlanta y'all don't know that but i'm from atlanta you feel me like all my family down there like that's where my grandma from like everybody's from Atlanta, you feel me, but we end up moving up here or whatever, but, um, yeah, though, so, I will be moving to Texas, y'all, um, I don't have, like, an actual date, you feel me, but I don't have a job right now, you feel me, and that's, I told y'all, if y'all watched that one vlog, when I had came from out of town with my friend, I had told y'all that the only thing that was holding me back from leaving and going to Texas was a job you feel me it was my main job but now that i got fired from that job it's like okay mk it's time to dip you feel me so i might shit i might move i might move out there next week you feel me like hey you feel me y'all better stay tuned to these vlogs you hear me but yeah though so i've been planning on moving to texas or whatever so like that's like you know something up my sleeve and stuff like that that i got going on right now but yeah i just really just been <coughs> I really just been, you know, in the house, you know, just just being by myself because, like I like I was tr about to say, it's like an off topic, but when I move out, like I'm really gonna be in the house though, for real, like you feel me, like I like I said, I be outside and stuff, and I like turning up and shit like that, but like I like I like being in the house too, like it ain't it ain't no problem for me to be in the house, you feel me, like. I could be in the house every single day if I really wanted to, you feel me? But, like, this chapter of my life right now, like, I, I I have to be outside, mainly because I do music, you feel me? So, like, when you do music, like, you got to do a lot of connections, you feel me? YouTube, I have to, you know, get different sceneries and, you know, go on places. Like, that's the hard part about YouTube and music, like, being, like, an influencer and stuff like that is because you have to be outside, like, 
<laughs> like, you have to be outside. You always got to have money because if you ain't got money, how you going to be outside? You feel me? So it's like, it comes with a lot. You feel me? So like, you feel me? I be having the, I be having like balanced stuff. You feel me? So the fact that I'm even like, the fact that I'm having like this little sit down real quick or like I'm, I'm sick and stuff, it's actually doing me a favor. You feel me? It's actually doing me a favor because... Oh, I love it when I when I put these glasses on, yo. I just feel so different. Like I just feel like, yeah, you feel me? Like I feel like I can just pull anybody. You hear me? Like I can already pull anybody without these. But like when I got the glasses on, it's just like, hello, okay, like what, okay. But no, though. Um, yeah, though. So like me being in the house right now, like it's really just therapy for me. You feel me? Because I ain't gonna cap y'all, like. I needed to sit down, you feel me? I, I needed to sit down, though, because I was out drinking every single day. You feel me? I'm not promoting that. But I was out drinking every single day. You feel me? One thing about it, MK is a Don Julio girl, okay? Nah. Hey, I was about to say something. I ain't going to say it. But MK is a Don Julio girl. Hello? You feel me? I can, I can drink on anything, you feel me? Because y'all got to understand, too. Like, my father, he is an alcoholic, you feel me? uh not even trying to put his business out there because that just sounded bad but um yeah though like liquor like that runs in my family bad like like for real y'all it, it runs in my family bad and i got it bad y'all like i'm not even trying to be funny but like mk has it bad y'all like <laughs> that's actually bad to say but no y'all i really i don't have a drinking problem but like because i haven't drunk i haven't drunk i haven't drunk in a long time you feel me when the last time i drunk I haven't drunk in some months, you feel me? I have not drunk in some months, but that's only because I'm sick right now, and I don't like to, you feel me? But not saying I can't stop. Like, I, I, if I don't if I don't want to drink, I don't have to drink, but I love I love it, okay? Oh, my God, that sounds so bad. Y'all, y'all get what I'm saying, though? Like, I'm not trying to be funny, neither. Like, I'm being for real, though. But, yeah, though, drinking, like, that's a big thing in my family, y'all. Like, they, they, them niggas are some alcoholics on my soul, and I think I got, like, the bad. I think I got it, but, like, I ain't got it, though. Like, the only reason I ain't got it because my mama saved me. My mama's side of the family, they saved me. You feel me? Because they don't, well, hmm, some of the family. You feel me? But my mama's side, like, my mama, like, she don't be doing all that stuff. You feel me? So, like, she kind of, like, my mama the reason why I'm really on a good track. Like, I ain't even going to cap to y'all. Because if it was up to my dad or if it was up to me, I would probably be, I would be, y'all, I would be, I would be, y'all, y'all wouldn't even know, know, know it was me. I'm going to keep it a band, like. Like, if I ain't have my mama to direct me and lead me in the right path, like, even right now, like, sometimes I'll be tripping and stuff like that. And like I said, I'll really be, you know, rocking with my family like that right now. But, you see what I'm saying? Like, sometimes when I'll be tripping, my mama, she be telling me, like, MK. Like, she don't say MK. Sometimes she call me MK. I tell her stop calling me that because that's weird. But she be trying to be funny when she said, though, and it's not funny. I don't find it funny at all. But, um... She be telling me, like, you need to stop. You need to sit down somewhere. She be telling me, like, you need to stop doing this. You need to stop doing that. Because I ain't going to lie. Just a couple minutes ago, I was mad. I ain't going to hold you. I was mad because my older sister, like, she be blowing me. She be getting on my nerves because she thinks she's somebody's mama and she needs to sit down somewhere. But she was blowing me. And I was cussing and stuff at her. And I had my mama on the phone. I was calling my mama, y'all. I was calling my mama to, like, Cause my mama be playing too much. My mama think everything is a joke too. That's where I get it from. But my mama, she always doing too much. Like something is really wrong with her, y'all. I'm not playing. But I was calling my mama because I was about to, I was about to like see was T. And as I as I was on the phone calling my mama, I was cussing on my sister at the same time. And my mama, <laughs> and my mama heard it. And she was like, get on me or whatever. But like that's why I'm outside right now because like leave me alone. But yeah though, so. That's T on that. But yeah, like life really great though right now, y'all. Um stuff's starting to come back together. So I'm really like I'm really proud of that. You feel me? Um yeah, I just I'm just feeling y'all in right now, venting to y'all. If y'all made it this far, you some you an OG. I really love you. Like if you really stayed this long, like that's actually crazy that you really did that. But I really I really like mess with you for that. Cause like I probably would have clicked off, you feel me, if it was up to me, because my attention span too short. But yeah, though, y'all, I just had to tell y'all that. Um, more videos gonna be coming. I got music dropping. I'm actually gonna drop a music video very, very soon. It's already filmed and edited, 
So I'm going to just, you know, go ahead and drop that out because I'm starting to put out music, y'all, because I got a lot of music that I have. I don't have that much music left because I've been putting so much music out. But I have a lot of music still that I'm trying to get out because a lot of them is old songs. Like, a lot of my music right now that I'm dropping is a lot of, like, old songs and stuff like that. So it's not really, like, my actual feelings, like, currently speaking. So, like... I don't want y'all, like, if y'all hear some stuff in my songs, like, I don't want y'all to think that it's, like, still happening, because it's not. Like, a lot of stuff that I talked about is, like, past wounds. Like, my songs that I'm putting out right now is past wounds that led up until this point. You feel me? So, like, my new music, I haven't even recorded no... I've been writing a lot, but I haven't put out no, like, currently speaking music, like, 2024 music. I have not put out now. I haven't even gotten a studio, like, recently. I haven't been in a studio in a long time. Uh, probably since like January, so I gotta get back in the studio. So when y'all when y'all hear this new music though, oh, it's a different side of MK. This is Savage MK. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. MK, I don't know when the next time MK gonna be in a relationship. Like, I just wanna vibe with people. I just not even people. Like, I don't even wanna vibe with a lot of people. I just wanna vibe. You feel me? Because like, I really can't. I, I really can't do the relationships right now. Like, I gotta get my money together. I gotta get my life together. I just got a lot of stuff that I got to get together right now before I even try to get into a relationship because a relationship comes with a lot. Um, I was in, you know, a long relationships. Like, all my relationships that I've had have been, like, pretty long, I think. You feel me? Like, it ain't that long, but they've been, they, it's been a good amount. Like, I'm a very, I'm a very, I'm a very excellent girlfriend, okay? I'm a very excellent girlfriend. In the bed, out the bed, whatever. You hear me? Like, one thing about them came... She know what to do. You hear me? And it don't matter who you is. I can change your life. I can change it. I can change your life. What? No, for real though. Like, that's real shit though. I'm not even gassing it. Like, that's real shit. Like, I, one thing about me, which y'all gotta realize is like, I'm not a girl who like to her own horn or who gas herself up. I don't have to. Like, the shit is just proven. Like, I don't have to do all of that. Like, Anybody can vouch. Nobody's going to say otherwise because they know it's false. And if they do, it's because they're mad because I'm not stunting them. You feel me? That's what it is. But I'm really her. Like, I'm the definition of her. Okay? And I thank God for that. Like, I'm not being for real, though. Like, I'm really the definition of her. Like, I'm actually going to get that tattooed on me very, very soon. Like, I'm actually her. Like, I can come into anybody's life and change it. I Like, I'm just her. Like, I'm I'm her. I am her period and that's humble that's humble i swear to god that's humble but i'm about to sign up out of here y'all uh make sure to like the video subscribe to the channel thank y'all so much for listening to me thank y'all for tuning into these videos y'all been running up my videos recently so i really appreciate that because it's, it, it's really y'all really the reason why i keep posting you feel me like when i see y'all comments and i see y'all like actually watching the videos like it make me want to keep dropping like every single day because I could really drop every single day if I wanted to. And it's like I got all this time on my hands. So it's like, MK, you might as well. Like, I hate not being I hate not being productive. I hate I hate not doing stuff. So it's like I be having to do stuff. But yeah, y'all, that's me updating y'all. Like I said, I got pneumonia in my left chest. So right now I'm trying to take it slow. I'm standing in the house. I'm hydrating. I'm doing all that fun stuff. So, yeah, y'all, keep me in y'all prayers. Uh, Let's keep on dropping these videos. And all that good stuff. Hopefully that answers y'all questions or anything y'all was looking for. And it's more to be it's more coming. Okay? It's more coming. But I'll see y'all next video. I love y'all. I'm out y'all. Peace. I can teach you how to love me if you want, baby. To infinity and beyond for the wrongs, baby. Let me show you how to look. Let's take our time, baby. I can give you what you want. Just take your time with me. We in the two sit I let her way you drive, baby. Got me standing at the wheel. It's perfect time, baby.